Good morning, everyone. How are you? Happy Wednesday. Um, really excited for another Get Fit class. I hope everybody's having a really good morning so far. Um, the sun is out, finally. It's not snowing yet, so that's good. Again, let me just wait for a few people to get on, so I'm just going to sit here and relax for a minute before we sweat. <laughs> Hello, everybody. How are you? Good morning. <laughs> hope you're having a really good morning. The sun is shining. It's a brand new day. Beautiful day. Who's ready to sweat? Get moving. So we can have our shower and relax on the couch. <laughs> Good. Okay. So again, I'm just going to wait just maybe one or two more minutes just for people to log on. I know some people have some issues with it. Uh, but until then, just stretch it out. Just reach up. Get your water. Get your chair. Your resistance band. Hey, Brad. <laughs> Excited to see you too. Thanks for coming. Hi, Julianne. Thanks for being here. Awesome. Cool. All right. So just another minute or so. Um, but I hope that everybody's doing okay through all of this. I know it's a, a challenging time and um, it's hard to be positive all the time and you don't have to be. That's okay. But um, just try to do the best you can and, and do what you need to feel better. If that's taking a couple days rest, if that's having a glass of wine in the bathtub, whatever makes you feel better. But I hope this exercise is a, is a little outlet for you to feel better and to feel good. Oh, thanks, Charlene. Lovely to have you. Hey, Gardena. <laughs> awesome. Okay, so I'm going to get going. So get ready. Reach up, side to side. 
Heel tap. Press it up. Get a little bit lower. Bicep curl. Squeeze the arms. Just a little bit lower, if you can. Push it up. Side to side. Legs go wide. Back to me. Down. Again, squeeze in the arms. You got it. Side to side tap. Reach across the body. Push it out. In the back, the arms. Push it down. And across, stand one leg. Slowing it down a little. Get a little lower in that leg. Reach it up. Other leg is bent. Hand on the hip for support. Other side, reach across. Make it your own. If you want to go slower, you go slower. Want to go faster? That's good too. Do your best. Forget the rest. Get a little lower. Reach it over. You got this. You should be breathing a little heavier now. March it out. Whew. Heel tap, push. Turn it into a low kick, push it up. For modification, stay with the heel down. Arms out to the side. Still with that kick, core is tight. Turn it into a high knee, pull it down. Really squeeze the core. Exhale, that leg comes up. You got it. Now bring it to me, forward. Good, 27 of you, awesome, bring it back. 
Bring it forward. Good, you got it. Last time, bring it back. Wide. If you wanna keep the leg low, that's okay. You don't have to bring it up super high. Squeeze the arms. Turn this into a leg curl. A little bit lower. Arms pulled down, you got it. Moving the whole body in one exercise for the most benefit. You've got this. Last three, two, one, 
bring it back. Tap. You're doing great. You got it. Now other leg steps back. Lunge, pulse. Arms up higher. Squeeze your core, reach it down. Remember to exhale as you bend. Your core must be tight. Three. One, step it back, tap it out. Woo. All right, let's have a break for the legs. Arms up again. Jab, cross. So my fists are squeezed, my elbows are soft. Chin down. Bend the elbow, give me a hook. Jab, one hook, jab, hook, jab, hook. Squeeze those arms, make them work. Three, two, one, hold it. Other side, jab. Remember to breathe out every time. Focus on the exhale. You'll automatically inhale. Don't stress about the breathing. Just make sure to breathe it out. Three, two, one. Uppercut. You're going to bend your elbow, flex the bicep. Keep the arms into the sides. Don't let them go out. It's not like this. It's in tight. 45 degree angle. Bring it to me. Breathe out with that punch. You got this. Bring it back. Do what you can. Forward. Bring it back. Stay here. Tighten up that core. Bring it low. You got this. Keep going. Bring it up high. All right, we're going to double it. Ready? Double. Make sure those knees are bent. I'm pushing off my toe. I'm squatting in between. Four more times. Three, two, one. Step, touch. How you feeling? You sweating now? I hope so. Step it back. Push it out. Don't just let the arms get loose. Keep them tight. 
Work the shoulders, work the chest. We're almost at the break. Okay, we're gonna slow it down, hands on the hips. One leg, heel, toe. You got it. My other leg is bent. Check the knee. Hands on the hips for support. If you want this to be easier, make it a small step. If you want it harder, step wide. Add those arms, get just a little lower. Focus on your breath. You should start to feel this in the legs, especially in that thigh. Okay, we're gonna speed it up in a second. Do what you can, your own speed. Ready? Go! Getting lower is gonna make it harder. Make it your own. Almost at that break. Can you give me just a little more? Bring it up. Slow. Get a little lower. You got this, you're doing a great job. Last time on this side, speed it up. You got it. Keep that core tight. This is a really good low impact way to raise that heart rate. Slow it down. Other side, just the leg. Heel, toe. You shouldn't trust me when I say we're almost done. Anyone who comes to my classes knows I'm a, I'm a bit of a liar that way. <laughs> and this last time, last exercise on this side, let me get that break. Add those arms. Knees are bent. Can you get a little lower? If not, that's okay. You can even keep the arms out if you want. Okay, we're getting ready to speed it up, so keep that core tight. Speed it up. Keep your breath going. Focus on it. And bring it up slow. One more time. Keep it slow. Bring it down. Knees are bent. And last time, ready? Speed it up. You don't have to go at my pace. You find your own pace that works for you. Last two. 
One, roll the shoulders back. Roll them forward. How's everybody feeling? Good. Feel that heart rate coming down. Nice and easy side to side tap. Little to no effort. We never want to stop moving completely while working out or just finishing a workout. You want to cool it down. You want to move a little slower. Give the body a chance to rest a little bit. Heart rate to come down. So when we're done this little cool down, try to avoid taking a seat if possible. Try to stay standing, try to stay moving a little bit. It's better for your blood pressure. Heel tap. Grab some water, grab a chair, grab a band, weights, whatever you got, um, and then we'll get to see it. We'll finish the workout. And I'm going to stay here and read your comments. I am a sweaty thing. I'm glad I have this. Who else sweats no matter what they do? Hi, Mirna. Hi, Cindy. Good morning. Hi. Hey, Janice. Really miss you, too. Hope you're doing okay. Hey, Maureen. Lovely to have you. Oh, it's so good to see your guys' comments. I miss you all so much. But at least we can connect this way, right? Makes it a little bit easier. I'm gonna grab some water. Whew. Karen, I'm sweating loads. Look at this. It's crazy. My hair is a nest. <laughs> I think I've created my own ecosystem in here. But I think that's quarantine life for me. Just not washing my hair and continually <laughs> exercising. It's a good combination, believe me. <laughs> Hi, Kathy. That's okay. Some people are better sweaters than others. That's all right. Hey, Lori. Glad you're liking the workout. Okay, grab your chairs, everybody. Hope you had some water. realized I didn't take down uh, the birthday decorations. It's my dad's birthday on the weekend. So if you notice that, just... Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'll move back just a bit. Anybody else have a quarantine birthday? Happy birthday, happy belated birthday. If you did, grab your band. You're going to reach out in front, arms straight. Pull it wide. Keeping those arms straight, going slow. This targets the back of the shoulders, the upper back. The best thing I do is go slow with control. Exhale as you pull. should not be straight. Keeping almost a 90 degree bend in that elbow. 
only pulling down to about the collarbone. Your hands should not be coming low like this. You should be upright like that. Squeeze your back. This. We're going to go just a little faster. Last two. One. Awesome. Lean back in your chair. Wrap the band around one foot. Press it down low. Pressing from the heel. You 
got this. Back down low to the middle. Three, two, one. Wrap it around the back. Sit up nice and tall. All right. One arm, reach it across. Reach it just a little higher. Remember, breathe out every time. Other side, across. Reach it up a little higher. You got this. Take a break if you need it. Really working the arms. Both arms, press it straight out. Bring it up, a little higher. Working the shoulders, upper chest. You should feel the burn. Three, two, one. Woo! Okay, add your chair. Legs step out, wrap the band around. Elbows in, palms out, one arm, bicep curl. Remember you want to flex from the bicep. We're not pulling from the wrist, so don't let the wrist bend. Keep it neutral. Other side. Keep breathing. We're almost done the workout. Both arms. Slow with control. Drop your band. Woo. Reach the arm across the chest. Oh, it feels good. I'm thinking on uh, switch arms first. <laughs> I'm thinking on Friday's class, instead of a band, I'll use light weights. If you have weights at home, that's awesome. If not, you can use, again, soup cans, laundry detergent, a duffel bag filled with clothes. Whatever you got, it's kind of fun to be creative that way. Interlace the fingers, push the arms up. Just thought it would be a nice little change. Let me know what you think. Hot field on the upper back. Slowly bend to one side. Other way. Good 
bring it up, reach it out. Really push those arms out. Bring it up, come to the edge of your chair. Step one leg back, sinking off. Feel that stretch here. Stay like this, or again, reach over, looking down. The wider your legs are, the more you're gonna feel the stretch. Just do what you can. Other side. Bring that down, come to the edge of your chair, cross the leg on top of the thigh or below the knee. Gently press on the thigh, not the knee, leaning forward. <sighs> I feel really good, I hope you do too. Love doing this with you guys, it's great. Keeps me busy and keeps me healthy as well, so thank you for being here. Other side. Bring that down. Good. Bring one arm to the shoulder or behind the head. Gently pull the elbow back. Sitting up tall. Feeling that stretch all over the tricep, the back of the arm here. Other arm. Gentle pull. Fold over, inhale, exhale, fold, big inhale, and exhale down. One, palms together, inhale lower, exhale, push it out. Great job, everybody. Thank you so much again for another awesome class. I hope you had a good time. I hope you're sweating, and I hope you have an awesome rest of your day. Hopefully see you on Friday at 10 o'clock. Bye, guys.